Afana, how na den now? Welcome to Sunday's communication. In case you do watch us for the first time, guess what? My gist gonna carry come for on that today. And before we go dive into the gist, as no no say me as a big gossip, well, well, more na so that more go on short to break. I go come hala on about the things we they suffer for Nigeria recently. <music> So the federal government don't present certificate of registration to the Congress of Nigerian University Academics. We be Konu and I waiting me call them. Shall I stand to be correct and now Sabi how they call them. So as a breakaway faction of the Academic Staff Union of Universities, which is what ASU. So the national coordinator for this new Congress of Nigerian University Academics, Na Niyi Sumonu, Pesiwe then talk say in be lecturer for Obafemi Awolowo University, OAU Ileife, and the federal government don't officially register them as a trade union under the federal government. As a matter of they wish, we can't they wonder what they do this Nigerian people say, what they do our government. The federal government made this development as they invite the reporter. They even invite reporter on Tuesday, 4th of October, by the Deputy Director of Press and Public Relations, who also be the Federal Ministry of um, Labor and Employment, person that they call Oshundun or Laji Day. We send invitation letter and I go read as the invitation letter talk rather. The invitation letter talk say the Honorable Minister of Labor and employment dr chris ingige cordially invites you to the recognition and presentation of certificate of um, registration to the congress of nigerian university academics confirming the development a source at the ministry of labor and employment talk tell daily trust say the presentation of this certificate of registration to the Konwa was moved by the government to do it in, to deregister ASU. Mo now wait now, wait till ASU can't talk for this matter. Shake the thing, shake them, I'll be in a shake them. The national president of ASU, President they call Professor Emmanuel Oshodeke, can't tell the news in Vanguard, say, hmm, what thing government like made them do it, made them do say that one no concern them. In talk say it is inconsequential as his union cannot be threatened by the development. In court continued talk say that does not in any way affect us. So we are a disciplined and focused union and we know what we are doing and what we are after. Let them register as many unions as they like. The sky is big enough for birds to fly. Can you imagine? <laughs> it's okay, shall but our federal government know they try. Person pick is there, so don't already reach one year. Now no even see house now go settle the matter with. It be like person we uh, we landlord we give house for ten tenant. The tenant is say the house get issues. You know solve that we can't go bring another tenant again. This is our country. Anyway, I know they surprised. Now so we they do. In case they continue talk, say as two members no be saboteur, say they no be boot leakers, say they get mission and vision. They know what thing they do. Say for this matter, we die, we die there. So the Gbedu Way Consort be say the Director General for the National Council of Arts and Culture (NCAC), person that they call Shegunru Shewe, don't ask the House of Representatives to make them give him council power, may him pursue the organizers of Big Brother Ninja over nudity in the reality TV show and the popular online crush dresser Bob Risky. On Tuesday, 4th of October, Nain in call when he appeared for the ad hoc committee investigating the duplication of ministry departments and agencies. In contact, say, new dates when they, they show for the popular show, say, in day too much, and it's in day against the culture of Nigeria. Say, you know, suppose they bring that kind of thing, bring for people, may then they see, say, you know, they all right. The, Director General states say the proper amendments of the Council's Act will allow them to go after the BB Ninja organizers and the cross dresser Bob Brisky. In come follow talk say I'll be the first person will carry Big Brother Ninja to the NBC to report them because of the nudity way then they show people for the television series. In call even talk say after he don't reach them, Big Brother Ninja organization try reach them, we then tell them tell them, tell them say every other culture, the Western culture, then they show them they even they do all sorts of things. We even pass the one with Big Brother Ninja they do. So they do it for their television um, shows and every other movie then they act. Say, in can them say if other countries they do this kind of thing, leave and no, no, do it. No, no, carry our call Nigeria because Nigeria be the country where we say we get integrity and we get culture we reach. So maybe they respect our integrity. Now we say integrity that. 
Rush away can't even tell the house. Say the only thing when they need supposed to do be say, maybe they just give and they go ahead. Say me go ahead, move, follow them. Say me they leave the many work for them. But still today now, you know as Nigeria be now, they never even hear anything. And more will not forget, say the National Broadcasting Commission get the power to sanction people where they air nude content for television. But the chairman of the committee, when they call Victor Danzaria, contest talk say governments they waste a lot of resources on agencies where they carry out the same function. In talk say this is a waste for the country. We are looking at areas that we can shrink governance and increase productivity. And more will not forget, say for 2019. NCAC don't already carry moves. Maybe say maybe they pursue these people where they do this kind of thing for signing into law of the 2008 nudity bill and in ban of this Big Brother Ninja reality TV show. But still today, till today, Big Brother Ninja still do it. It's still they go and nobody they do it. In. They talk anything. People supposed to carry out all this thing. They make their money now and nobody won't lose. So they're not gonna do the words, the right thing. But God they shall. So as some they win, I ain't some they do it in some they lose. Some people sit down, then they gather, they sweat up and now send me them bamboo brother Niger. And some people they wait in, then they even they, they, they enjoy that they, they celebrate, they bring brother Niger, they give them what they cash, 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 and you know it's ego. So now now no now say the big brother Niger season seven show where everybody they call level up now. As big brother Niger don't tell us say now level up. Me, I'm not seeing the thing with the level shop, but thank the Lord. It has come to an end on Sunday, second of October 2022. And Fina now you win the show. The reality TV show and um, where everybody know say na fina 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 fina. According to you know internet now, after we don't Google, 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 we don't find out say her real name na Ijoma Josefina Otabo and she be indigenous of Edo State, Nigeria. She beats Brian, who be the runner up, and about 25 other housemates as she come do it in fight the battle fight so that she can't even claim the price of about 100 million naira. According to Daily Trust, Fina was born on the 2nd of June 1997 and Wikipedia referred to Fina as Nollywood actress and hype man even though I never seen her for any movie though I don't even watch film like that sha. but she's something that she an actress she be and according to her fans we believe say of what the big brother Ninja house means say Fina was the life of every party and you can't even give her one nickname they call her hype priestess they say now she get the most authentic personality for the show. And during an interview, Fina herself can't tell us say of all the plenty talents which she where she get, she even they repair home appliances. Truth be told, nobody everybody will come talk that kind of thing because it'll be like um fashion collection. Because everybody now, every time where they come, they go talk say the village is in the fashion collection, the guys they always be gym instructors. So the multi-talented singers, hype woman and them singer and hype woman and them recent winner of the reality show tell us during an interview at the beginning of the show say as she don't come call come she not only come for the money but she don't also come make she can make huge difference for the show and indeed she don't make her because not be every time woman they win like that. I can't remember the last time um, a lady won the show. Anyway, congratulations Fina and we hope say you go use the money do better. It may not be like white money. Maybe because in dance a big game once more, but stop saying go win Grammy in the next one year. I beg be realistic as you don't do already. Congrats and have a good life. The Nigerian singer Iriolu Waola Dimeji Aloba, where all of us know as the Mobad on one end, as in post that video, say management team beat him. Like the Mali talk, say he no thing, say now nah, what thing happen with that. Say if they ask him, say he go talk, say na family affair with this matter. Say even though because Mobad don't already carry the matter go social media, he no go even address him. Say he they sure say Mobad no know what thing they talk. Say in don't already shy you. Mobad can't talk for in post for his own of his social media and you say he you know they hire you because he knows anything and they go talk saying he don't shy you. Say he you know no way thing they talk. Say he you know what thing they talk. Where where? Say now nah, the management team beat him like that. Mali and Kong already, I mean, Mali can't tell us, say, Mobad already get history for intoxication. Say, whenever he don't drink like that, say, emotions, they didn't want kind, one kind. Say, me, we don't mind that. Say, in short, say, if Mobad don't come back to his senses, say, he go, come, come, apologize, and come explain to Ram the reason why he carry matter has seen carry out. So, anyways, we pray, say, they don't go kill him, fana, 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 as we don't know the reason why all these things they happen. You know, say, we never even know the true matter for the story. But, we're going to follow the gist now, we'll go see how the matter go hand and we we'll go holla una as soon as we gather tangible and you know sensible information about this. Hopefully, we are all hoping that uh, Mobad no day in sense is true true. 
But if indeed sense is then we have to do it in. We have to look into this matter and we hope that the right measures are taken. Don't forget in Asondo's communication, this our station B and my name is Adenaike Jane Thank you very much and God bless you.